Welcome to Infa Minutes. We take problem on strain energy and we consider strain energy due to bending of beams. A problem statement is show that strain energy of a simply supported beam carrying UDL equal to W Newton per mm is given by U equal to W square into L to the power 5 upon 240 EI where this L stands for length of the simply supported beam and EI is Young's modulus and moment of inertia of the cross section of the beam. So let us first draw a representative diagram of simply supported beam carrying a UDL equal to W Newton per meter. So this figure represents a beam which is simply supported at point A and B by means of hinge support at A and roller support at B and there is a UDL of W Newton per meter over its whole length L. Now we've been asked to find out the strain energy stored in the beam due to this loading and we have to prove that the strain energy stored is given by this formula. So now let us solve the problem. First let us consider two vertical support reactions and let us assume those two support reactions are upward denoted by VA and VB at point A and B respectively. So our first step is to determine the support reactions V and VB by using static equilibrium equation we have the first equation is summation of m about point A equal to 0. Now writing the bending moment about point A of all the forces and couples we have a sign convention is clockwise moment is positive and anti-clockwise moment is negative. So from point A we have a clockwise moment caused due to this downward UDL of intensity W Newton per meter acting for the whole span L. So we have W into L and this load can be assumed to act at the center that is L by 2 from point A. So multiplied by L by 2. Also we have this anti-clockwise moment caused due to this upward vertical support reaction VB acting at a distance of L from point A. So we have minus VB into L and summation of this whole moment is equal to 0. Now upon solving this we get the value of VB as WL by 2. Now since this whole terms is positive or VB is positive which means that our assumption is correct and the vertical support reaction VB is upward. Now let's apply the another static equilibrium equation which is summation of all vertical forces F phi is equal to 0. Now we'll consider all this upward forces in this beam diagram. A sign convention is upward forces positive and downward forces negative. So we have two upward forces VA plus VB and the downward force is this UDL of intensity W acting for a span L. So we have minus W into L and summation of all this vertical force is equal to 0. Now substituting the value of VB from this in this equation we get VA as VA plus WL by 2 minus W into L is equal to 0. So therefore VA is equal to WL by 2. Again this whole term is positive so our assumption is correct and your vertical support reaction VA is also upward.